Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to pan and zoom 3D models in PowerPoint 2016. In a previous tutorial, I showed you how to animate 3D models using the Morph Transition. First, let me show you a quick example of the pan and zoom animation using this 3D globe model. Well, hope that gave you a good idea of the pan and zoom animation. Now let me show you how. Let's start by inserting the 3D model of the globe. So go to the Insert tab and click on 3D Models. You will see these two options. Choose from online sources. You will need an internet connection. Next, you will see this dialog box with various categories. You can use the search box. I will search for the globe. And I'll choose this one, and then click Insert. Once you insert the 3D model on the slide, you can use these handles to increase the size if you need to. Also, you will notice this icon in the middle of the model. You can use it to rotate the 3D model, like so. If you right-click on it, you will see this Pan and Zoom option. And if you select it, you will see this magnifying glass icon. And if you click on it, you can zoom in and zoom out of the 3D model, like so. In order to create the animation I showed you earlier, you can use the Morph Transition. So let me do a quick demo. I'll use the same slide as a starting point. First, I'll duplicate the slide by right-clicking on it and then choosing Duplicate Slide. On the duplicated slide, I will enlarge the 3D model to full screen, like so. Next, I'll use this rotation button to rotate the image. Next, I'll use the pan and zoom option to zoom it in. Finally, I'll go to the Transitions tab and apply the Morph Transition. And this is how the pan and zoom animation looks like. You can slow down the speed of the animation in the Timing section. In the animation that I showed you earlier, I created a series of slides of the globe in various positions and applied the Morph Transition to achieve that animation. Well, hope you found this tutorial helpful. Feel free to check my other PowerPoint tutorials. And thanks for watching.